Welcome to Bloomington Today. I'm Kaylin Clement. Thanks for joining us. Now it's time to bring you the buzz on Bloomington Today for the week of October 23rd through the 29th. As Bloomington continues to move toward the goal of becoming a more sustainable community, city facility maintenance crews have turned their attention towards some bright ideas inside the government offices. Facility Maintenance has spent the last several months researching and converting metal halide lights to new fluorescent fixtures in the public works garages. These lights cut energy costs in half while improving the overall quality of light in the building. Over at Civic Plaza, incandescent bulbs have been replaced with LED light bulbs. So far, the Inez Greenberg Gallery, the Atrium Gallery, and the house lights inside the Schneider Theater have been converted to LEDs. Energy usage with these conversions decreased nearly 80%. Lower fuel costs, less congestion, and healthier, more sustainable environment, those are just a few of the benefits associated with carpooling. And during the month of October, you can win a $500 gas gift card from Commuter Services by taking the Carpool Pledge. Head to 494corridor.org and click the Carpool to Work Month link. From there, it's easy to enter and win. All you have to do is carpool to work or school at least once during the month of October. Carpooling minimizes wear and tear on vehicles, and today it's not uncommon for employers to offer incentives for using this alternative mode of transportation. So go ahead, give carpooling a try this month. After 19 weeks, the City of Bloomington has wrapped up another outdoor farmer's market season. Event organizers say it was a very well-attended season full of local food celebrations, cooking demonstrations, art activities, and live music. They'd like to extend a warm thank you to residents who visited the market rain or shine and waited out the tough start to the season following an unexpectedly long winter. Residents are also invited to mark their calendars for November 9th and December 14th. From 9 a.m. until noon on these select Saturdays, Bloomington's indoor market will take place inside Civic Plaza, located at 1800 West Old Shakopee Road. There, market goers will find their favorite winter produce like onions, carrots, potatoes, and apples. In addition, both markets will include pork products, cheese, chocolate, baked goods, and decorative winter crafts. Perfect gifts for the upcoming holiday season. Now we'll take a look at another Arts at the Plaza segment. From now until November 24th, the Inez Greenberg Gallery will play host to the 37th annual Members Juried Art Exhibition. Each year, the exhibit brings together works by the many talented members of the Bloomington Theatre and Art Center. The pieces always vary, showcasing different mediums, styles, and techniques. Entries will be judged by Groveland Gallery Director Sally Johnson. Ms. Johnson has selected pieces for awards, including a $400 Best of Show Award. And that is the buzz on Bloomington today for the week of October 23rd through the 29th. Thanks for joining us.